What's going on guys? Going to be doing a little flight time test today with this battery. It's a Zippy Compact 3700. This is the 35C series. Uh, I actually have another one of these batteries. It's a 25C. And uh, this one is a little bit lighter, so I may get a little bit better flight time with that one, but I don't have the right connectors on there, the XT60. So uh, it's slightly windy out here at uh, Montgomery Waller Park. I'll probably stick this little camera tripod on that rail over there and then uh, maybe do a nice hover. See how long I can get it to hover for without uh, get the battery down as low as I can, probably about 10 and a half volts or so. And um, I'll do a time lapse recording for that got my uh, 450 quad here with my Turnigy 9XR KK 2.1 I put all the all the parts in the description if you want to see exactly what I have on here I recently crashed this and um, I don't know if you can see you can see the little bend in the prop right there I actually bent two of these props pretty good I managed to bend them back and uh, it still flies. <laughs> I try to get the props as true as I possibly could by bending them back, but um, we'll see how that does. Uh, let's go ahead and start the flight. I got about 16 minutes and a few seconds on this battery with the 35C. Uh, I'll do another video with the 25C. This is a little bit lighter. I'll see if I can get maybe uh, another minute or so on that battery. But um, I have this. Uh, I have the board set to start beeping at uh, 10.5 volts, and when I landed it, I got a 10.9 volts. So I probably could have flown it for another minute or so but um, just wanted to keep things consistent so I'll do another test with the other battery and uh, we'll see how that goes <laughs> 